Well, we've been doing some things with scissors. And it's important to learn how to use scissors because they're a very useful tool. When you're just starting out learning how to use scissors, it's really tempting to use them for things that we shouldn't use them for. Um, it's not a good idea to cut your own hair because you could slip and cut your nose or cut your eye. That's, that's a dangerous thing. Cutting your clothes is also dangerous. You could cut your skin and if you cut your clothes, it doesn't heal. And then sometimes your clothes aren't, they don't keep you warm anymore because there's big holes in them. So <clears throat> don't, don't cut your own hair or your friend's hair or your brother's hair or your sister's hair. Let your mom deal with that cutting hair or, you know, go and see somebody that cuts hair. That's, that's their job because they study really hard and they, they practice a lot to cut hair, to make it look good. Um, most people that cut their own hair are not very happy that they did that later. Um, cutting other things at your house, um, your doll's hair, your toys, um, that's probably not a very good idea either because it doesn't grow back, it doesn't heal. Once you cut it, it's cut for good. But I've got something that you can cut. So this is a face and I'm putting some hair, some yarn on this face for hair. When you get this, it will have hair on it. You can use your scissors, check with mom or dad or whichever grown up is supervising you. Check with them first. But this is so that you can cut the hair. Now, when you cut this, cut all the hair off, there are holes up here that you can put more hair on. This is how you're going to do it. Take your yarn and you fold it in half like that. So you've got a little loop here at the top and two ends here. Take the loop and poke it through the hole like that. And then you've got a loop there. Take your two ends, put them through the loop. There you go. So you can, you can use this, you can put you can put more yarn on it as forever as long as you don't cut this. So just cut the yarn. And then you'll have this that you can you put long hair on it and cut it short. You can put short hair on it and cut it shorter. You can put different colors of hair on it. So it's a good thing for practicing cutting. I hope you have fun with it. I'll talk to you later. Bye.